State Council Celestino Watch told the magistrate that seven of the nine officers involved had declined to attend court despite having been served with court summons and could not be reached on phone. The investigating officer in the case informed the court that some of the officers from the Elite Flying Squad who tracked the presidential escort car to Uganda have been transferred to other stations outside Nairobi. And I made the order in a case where an Akuru based mechanic Nelson Topicho, Agri Odiambo, Robert Mande, Andrew Young, and Geoffrey Oma have denied robbing a presidential guard, David Maina Machui, his official car with civilian registration valued at 1.2 million shillings. The five have also been accused of robbing a World Health Organization employee, his vehicle in Embakasi, Nairobi County, before dumping him at Kamulu. Hearing resumes on June 19th. And hearing of a case involving the Kirima family continued today with the family asking the High Court to evict over 1,300 squatters who have invaded its Njiru farm valued at 5 billion shillings. Represented by lawyers Wilfred Nyamu, the Kirimas told Justice Samuel Okongo that the squatters invaded the farm after the death of the former Starei MP in 2010. Despite court orders halting any activities in the farm, both the squatters and the Kirima family are worried about the ongoing constructions. The squatters who claim to be homeless are concerned with the December 5th hearing date, praying to the court to have the dates reviewed. Finally, Capsarite Member of Parliament Oscar Sudi can now breathe a sigh of relief after High Court Judge Hedwig Moody excused him from appearing in court on Monday as directed by a lower court. Moody, in considering Senior Counsel Tomo Gender's application, ruled that in view of the ongoing nomination exercise, the legislator may appear on the 8th of May when hearing of his criminal case kicks off. Anti-corruption magistrate Felix Combo had on Wednesday issued summons to the legislator to appear in court on Monday to explain his absence failure to which a warrant of arrest will be issued against him. Lilian Otieno for Scales of Justice.